So let's talk about side effects. I would never say it's a side effect anyway. I would always say it's a good thing. Um, but side effects for people who have never experienced it before. Let's talk about side effects about Reiki first of all. So the experience of having a Reiki session on the bed is normally um, the physical body purges or it, the emotional body purges, one or the other. Sometimes that happens here physically on the bed when you're having the session. So in other words, you might find that the emotion comes up to the surface in the midst of the session. And that's a good thing because nothing that I can't handle and certainly not that you can't because if the emotion is coming up for you, that means that your guides know that you're ready to let go of any trials, traumas, any um, uh, emotional boxes that you have closed and suppressed or parked. The physical experience is that the body purges, so you might find your tears are running but no emotion. The, uh, you start to cough more, you start to cry on the bed, that's also a good thing. There's always loads of tissues here. So as, as, as far as I'm concerned, there's nothing that you are going to do for me that I have not seen before, so let it go here. I want you to walk out the door and float float out the door, not walk out the door, float out the door. Um, the physical experience that you have as you go home to your house will be that you have more um, loo breaks, going to the toilet more, physically weighing loads. Um, you may have a dose of the runs, that's a good thing. Basically getting rid of the crap, it's as simple as that. You might have a physical purge where you feel like you want to vomit, that's also good. Because if it's vomit, it's coming from the stomach and it's coming from the sacral chakra and also from um, the solar plexus. So it's coming from that area and it needs to purge up so it'll actually physically show you that it's coming up and out. I also have women who have lots of root chakra energy so after having an experience of Reiki they might find that their period is a bit heavier that when it comes to the time of the month it's darker that's also a purge. Um, you might find that you get emotional purges when you go home. In other words, you'll find that the energy comes to the surface. So if there's any anger, any um, big energies in your body where you feel like there's rage or um, bitterness or resentment, um, the emotions that normally comes up through um, anger and you'll feel like you get quite aggressive. We don't want you to bash anyone. We want you to bash a pillow. Go home, get a pillow, give a, give a pillow a good few digs and get out the uh, energy in that way. See it as um, an experience where it you will get better from. It is always like going to the gym. You feel fabulous walking out the door and then you feel absolutely crap two or three days later because the physical body is purging. The lymph drainage is purging in, in the gym. It does the same here. Your physical body purges. So see it always as a good thing. Never see it as a negative. We're led to believe it's always been a negative if we have any experiences of purging, whether it's coughs, colds, uh, viruses where we have the runs that is actually a good thing for your body we need it so enjoy the process namaste